All right, Finding Light, the Night of Heaven. This is using a really retro black and white aesthetic for some reason. Use the arrow keys left or left click to move and select Z to confirm, X to cancel. F1 to toggle full screen, F5 to reset. Heard, yes. As monsters of my asthma poured forth from the Black Tower, heroes Marie and Abby climbed the tower and defeated its master, the wizard Morgoth. That tower looks way bigger on the outside, huh? Two years later, Abby vanished. At the same time, a towering spire emerged, stretching from the ocean steps to beyond the sky. Heaven's door, as some call it, caused the oceans to flood, submerging cities, kingdoms, and even entire continents. As the world is slowly engulfed in darkness, the light waits patiently for new heroes to arrive. Sorry. Marie, are you in here? What do you need? There you are. Vera wants to talk to you. She says it's important, that's all. So it's canonical that Vera survives. Sister, what would she need from me? And Marie is playable this time. Strange. Ice and Wish. Cloth. Hmm. Oh, we have an SP system as well. Healing, but it requires me to actually have SP in the first place. So it might not be reliable if I have trouble generating SP. 100G? There's no guide for this game for some reason. Uh, did Firefly skip it? And Marie can equip a bow. Hmm. Manual? Okay, but the manual does not change your difficulty, so it's hard mode for every battle, not just bosses. I can save anywhere. The forest. It's about time you got out of bed, sleepyhead. We've all been worried about you. When Roxy consumes me, she copies both the stats and the skills of the enemy. Not all enemies drop meat, though, like enemies who aren't made of meat, for example. She also copies stuff like elemental weaknesses and resistances, so keep that in mind. Oh. It's, it's, it seems like a, 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 a similar to what Sylphie used. I should probably see what Vera needs first. You can hold shift to run or you can toggle auto dashing in the options menu. You probably already knew that, but I figure I'd tell you. This forest was once inhabited by nymphs and fairies, but most of them died a few years ago. Come think of it, you and Vera were the, were the our last ones, right? Would you like to learn how your character's stats work? Yes. Attack is physical damage. Hmm. Strength increases accuracy as well. Intellect increases damage done with spells and skills, while spirit will increase healing done with healing spells. Intellect and spirit will both raise your magic evasion. Agility affects your party uh, when your party members will uh, act in combat as well as increasing evasion and accuracy. Luck increases your chance to strike critically for double damage. Remember, you can do all these stats by selecting status in the menu screen. Hmm. We don't get much business here. How's 1G sound? No. How much do the enemies drop, though? And then the weapon shop. A slime. Oh, it also sells basic items. Mm, I already have this equipped, but I could use a hat. Oh, I can equip spells. And text. And relics. That's a lot of stuff to equip. Riff! Marie, it's time for you to leave the forest. What? Why? I will not allow you to languish in your own suffering any longer. Abby's waiting for you to save her. She needs you. There's nothing you can do. She was the knight in shining armor, not me. I'm just a forest nymph. You're stronger than that. You saved me. You saved the forest. I know you can do it again. I've seen you do it. Roxy? 
Roxy will aid you. As a spirit box, she can consume the meat of enemies to become stronger. Use her well. Is, are these permanent boosts? Because she's supposed to get, gain their weaknesses as well. I can't do this. Troubles of Westvale. Find allies who can help you. I believe in you, dear sister. Now you must learn to believe in yourself. You must learn to believe in yourself, dear sister. Your companion is counting on you. Uh, but I don't have a whole lot of items to go on. Wh possibility? Whoops. Hey, wait. Huh? You gonna join? I know it's been a while since you went out. If you like, I can give you a refresher on comment basic stuff. You know, like a tutorial. Sure. Great, let's begin. Welcome to the battle tutorial. Uh, uh, since this is your just a practice spike, go ahead and try attacking you and using spells. Don't worry, you won't get hurt. Ice on Hawk. Fire on Hawk because I have no SP. Hit point or hit points is how much uh, you, uh, damage you can take before being knocked out. Keep your hit points tied with potions and cure spells. If hit points reduce to zero, the character will be knocked out and unable to act or recover until they've been revived with a raised item uh, uh, or if, uh, if you visit an inn. And of course, if your entire party is KO'd, game over. You can use ice as well? I didn't even fill up my SP that much. MP is used to cast spells. Black magic such as fire will damage enemies, while white magic such as cure will rec aid and recover allies. Use MP wisely. If it runs out, you can restore it with certain items or by resting at an end. Ah, smite! Howl. Wait, there's no a d description showing what each skill does. That's kind of a UI uh, issue. I know you want to be retro, but that still seems kind of bad. SP or skill points are needed to use skills, naturally. SP is gained and developed by attacking, taking damage, evading attacks, etc. Skills can do all kinds of neat stuff. I better write this stuff down in the, uh, on my notes so that I know exactly what they do. I don't want to memorize everything. Here's a small tip. In combat, characters can defend to reduce damage right round, gain 25 TP and 10% of max MP. It's useful if you don't need extra attack. Strength and agility up. Ow. Gold combat is to reduce the enemy's hit point to zero while keeping yours high for next fight. Remember that, and keep potions handy in case you need to recover from post fight. Anyway, I think that's all you need to know for now. Here's some free XP and gold for participating. Seaweed and herb found. That was fun, wasn't it? Anyway, when you visit a new town, make sure to visit the equipment shops like the one over here and upgrade your equipment. Spell herbs are also bought from shops and equipped just like anything else. And be sure to visit inns like this one to purchase items and recover your party's hit point MP. And that's all I've got. There's plenty more I could explain, but I find it funner to learn by experience and just and to just be told everything. Wouldn't you agree? Hey, I got to keep my SP at least. Does that mean I retain SP after battle? I hope so. Okay, but I don't know how likely I am to be able to run from battles. Last time it was not guaranteed, so it might not be guaranteed this time either. How do I get down there? Oh, I see. Potion. Yeah, I can see a little bit of land underneath the bridge. Aha. Seems evading grants you a little bit of SP as well. Pretty G. Okay, now we're in Westvale. It's been a while, huh? Marie, it's been a while. Say, where's Abby? You two are always together. If you're looking for folks to travel with, I hear there's a wizard hanging around the pub. A piece of paper floated down from the sky and landed by one of those gravestones earlier. No, I'm serious. It came from way up in the sky. You don't believe me, do you? A piece of paper? Rip Dylan, may you rest in peace wherever you lie. Page 1 out of 5. Wait. Looks like some sort of clue for something hidden, but I don't think it's for anything around here. Dylan, was that Uno's original name? I don't remember. One plant in the second row is a switch. Activate it. Crops have been growing so well since the flying. I'd offer you some, but there's just not enough. I'm a former knight of Polonia. 
The castle was destroyed two years ago by a meteor, and everyone who was there died. I heard rumors that the city's holy weapon still resides there, but I wouldn't dare check. Seeing my beloved city in ruins would drive me crazy. Sylvanaras? The flying has taken away many cities and thousands of lives. As a man of faith, I can't help but have a feeling God is punishing us for our sins. My hometown, Gavinport, was lost in the flying. It was horrible. They've been right summer sale started. Can you believe it? So many good deals lost to the waves. Marie, it's been so long. Are you and Abby looking for work? Wait, where's Abby? Don't tell me she's... So it's Kanan that Abby... Uh, 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 Abby's a she. I'm so sorry. I wish I could help you somehow. Well, if you're gonna look for... You'll need potions, right? Take some. They're on the house. I owe you a lot more than uh, that after all you've done, but with how lousy business is lately, I can't afford to give more. Keller, is that you? It's been a while, hasn't it? How are you doing? Where's Abby? Well... She's gone. That's terrible news. I'm so sorry. However, I can't help but wonder if the appearance of the tower and Abby's disappearance are connected. You might be right. Why don't we go there together? It's not that easy, unfortunately. The tower is protected by a barrier. We can't enter it by normal means. If we had an entrance, it would be underground. But I haven't the slightest idea how we'd get there. My old friend Ned might know a way. He should live in here in town somewhere. Then let's go see him. Lead the way. Keller joined the party. It's level 3. Dang, I shouldn't have leveled up so much. Healing. He has decent intellect growth. If I could give him an offensive spell as well, that'd be great. Wolf and Hawk. I never got this to drop. Whoa! Oh! Oh, I see. You have to change... Uh, she, she was already... Uh, uh, ha uh, uh, wolf to begin with, so this changes the entire skill set. Hmm. I don't know. I like the, having the buffs of the wolf. Cure. Ice, fire, bolt. It's great to see you again, Marie. If my daughter were here, I'm sure she'd be delighted to see you too. Is she okay? It's been a long time. Oh, she's fine. Just traveling with her friends as usual. Anyway, what would you like to look at? Hmm. Then I have been trying to combine my medicine with his technology, but not with much success. Yo, what do you guys need? We're wondering if you know a way to get underground so we can access the tower. That's a tough one. We'd have to start by getting you underwater, but first you need an air source. What about pure air? From the kingdom in the sky, it's worth trying, but then they need to find a way to fl fly up there. I know a man named Stray who can give us a lift. I'm sure someone from the town of Northshire will know his whereabouts. Stray? He's still alive? Northshire, where is that? Northeast, we'll sail there with my ship docked outside. I suppose Northeast it is, then. Hold on, before you go, take this. Log. It's a key item. If you ever forget where you go next, give it a check-in and it should help you out. Okay, Stray, get pure air. Then we'll go from there. Some devout believe the tower is a gateway to heaven, even going so far as to call it Heaven's Door. Like, Hellgate? Perhaps it's God's way of t testing our faith. The hero of Westvale returns. What brings you here? Work? I'm sad to say we're a little short at the moment. Alright, there is a map in the mini guide, but I'm not sure if uh, visiting the cave is optional or not. Yeah, the dragon caves are probably too strong. The cave is listed next in the numbering, so hopefully that's the correct way to go. I still don't know about uh, that uh, about this second row of plants that they're talking about, though. Potion. Hunting. Less power, but more MP. A bit more balanced, huh? Magic. Stray, you must be talking about the spiky-haired guy. He was at the pub last I saw him. Hmm. Is this the magic shop? Yeah. Some basic buffs as well. But I need more money. Cleave sounds really powerful. Oh, if Stray joins the party, that would be good. Then like, it'll be easier to grind up some more money. Orb? What? Is one of your party members po if one of your party members is poisoned, he or she will take damage every turn in combat and while walking around outside. It's better to cure it ASAP. I wish she used to live in the underbog of the, the northeast. Don't know what happened to her, though. Yeah, how, did, did those two even survive the Black Tower? Can, in, in Timeline 2, they were supposed to... They survived, but... Not, we don't know about Timeline 1. 
Hi, you found me. Feels like just yesterday I was in Helonia watching the wedding of Lady Ruth and her wife Gwendolyn. That was ten years ago. I wish I could relive those days. What happened to those two? I firmly believe the end times are here, so I pray for a miracle. If you're about to f face this iron challenge, check around the area for a magical rose. It'll recover your party. It's gonna be hard to identify the rose, though. When I was really little, Daddy would tell me the sto story of a hero named Ruth who saved the world. I wonder if she'll come to save us again. Is she alive? Hello, friends. Have you come to hear tales of gods and men? Yes. The story goes that life began with two gods, the goddess Helena and the god Zamus. Together they created life. Helena came to love her creation. Samus, however, he believed he wants to be too cunning and resourceful. When Helena fell in love with a human, Zamus was driven to rage and sought to end humanity once and for all. When Zamus slayed Helena's lover, she fell into despair. She sacrificed herself to bless humanity with protection from Zamus's rage. To this state, it says that Zamus still plots to end humanity, as he feels nothing but hatred for the mortal creations that his sister goddess cherished. That is all. Thank you for listening, faithful ones. Seriously, why why does, does the Kingdom of Zamasse worship this guy? Are you just masochists? Former leader of the Dragon Knights of Alonia hangs around here sometimes. Remembers that his dragon abandoned him after the castle was hit by a meteor. Really? That sucks. And those are a little cheaper than, here than elsewhere. Log like poisonous creatures come out of the underbog. Stinger. Raise. Remove KO. I'd like to go to Enderbog to get our herbs, but the monsters have been much more aggressive lately. Looking for Stray, he just left. He south north east toward Enderbog he did. Or at least I assume so since he was packing his bags with antidotes. Stay in night in Northshire, H E. Why try to enter Helonia? It's there, but it's kind of broken. It's too heavy for us to move. What's this? The Holy Sword of Benaras. Ten years ago, the Knight Roof used it to slay Typhus the Worldbreaker. That's about all I know. If Shrey were here, he would likely know more about it. Okay, the Underbog. There's no poison tiles, are there? Yes, there are! Antidote. Okay, the darker tiles I must avoid at all costs. Oh, hell, I have unavoidable damage. 40G. High potion. Oh, no. Raise. Ugh. Oh, there is a secret treasure here. Too bad I had to take so much pain to get it. Power. Wait, did I miss this one before? Hmm. Potion. Fire one. So does that mean the enemy here is weak to fire? Heal. 20G? Is that the boss? But I see a flower. Healed, but saved in a separate slot. Gazer and Flytrap. Fire. This is very bad. Poisoned AoE? Yeah. Why is it that every first boss in every game seems to just spam ailments crazier than later bosses? Anyways, cleave. You have fire as well? Oh my gosh, I'm dying. Poison Nah. Fire. Fire.
I don't think fire is a good choice against you. Hell. Poison off. Bio? Bite. Here, X. I don't think it procced. We have a major advantage now that the minions are dead. This thing uses all elements. I'm not sure magic is going to be effective, huh? Attack. Bite. Smite, maybe? Oh, Smite was actually pretty good against it. That actually did more than a physical attack. Alright, let's see if we can recruit Stray to the party. What? That's... Is that Gwen's house? Pendant? Poison immunity. That would have helped a lot earlier. Damn, they're not here. I should have known better. Um, hello, anyone in here? Roof? Wait, you're not- who are you? You look familiar. Keller, right? You're Morgoth's apprentice. Well, was, yes. It's good to see you again, Stray. Last we saw each other, you were but a child. And this is my friend Marie. A nymph from the forest village. It's nice to meet you, but I'm assuming you guys followed me out here for a reason. We need your help reaching a kingdom in the sky. Can you fly us there? Nope, sorry. What? why not? He lost Straza somehow. My dragon Straza left me. I can't fly without her. Sorry, there's nothing I can do. Why? From the tales I heard of Helonia's greatest dragon knight, he and his dragon were inseparable. Yeah, well, things change. Helonia's gone now. I couldn't save it. There's nothing you could have done. It doesn't matter. Everything was taken from me. My country, my king, my dragon. My family. You must have something left to fight for. Stray, join us. We can't do this without you. I told you, I can't help. Besides, I don't have the will to fight anymore. My partner Abby was taken from me. She was everything to me. If you can't help, then she'll... And my former master is gone as well. We are familiar with loss, Stray. If you're here, you must believe Ruth and Gwen are still alive, right? What do they think of you now? Damn, you figured it out. You have a good point, too. We can find Straza at Dragon Rock, but I don't think she'll be happy to see me. Let me guess, she's gonna be the next boss. I'm sure we can convince her. Let's go, let's go. The censure is unbearable. Stray joins. It's level 5? Did they actually expect me to be that boss at level 5? Hmm. It's not... He's more of a physical attacker, huh? I can tell from his moveset. Impale. Yeah, even at level 5, he has more hit points than Marie. He's supposed to be a tank of the party, even though in the... Maybe this time he's supposed to be a tank, even though in the previous uh, ga uh, games he was supposed to be the s uh, speed damage type. Dragon Rock is a big cave network to the southwest. Also, there's a shortcut uh, here on the left. I can't use it to get back, though. Oh well, no need to. I think I already got all the chests worth getting here. Leave. Fire one. Fire one. Fire one. Rock toss. Here. 
here. Attack. It's gonna be awkward of him. Uh, yeah, seriously, he is pretty damn strong for his level. I guess that's what you get for being the, a protagonist of a previous game. But you should probably check out Holonia at some point. Alright, Stray. Sylvanaras. Can we use it? No, Rufa had an enchantment placed on it to keep it here. She meant for it to be a symbol of peace. She never told me how to remove it. Not that I deserve to wield it anyway. Ulo, the blacksmith who set this up, would know how to remove the enchantment, but I don't know where he is anymore. Hmm. Deep Forge, maybe? Thanks for tuning in to this Let's Play of Finding Light. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit a bell icon.